<laughs> Ladies and gents, this is 317 Sniper from YouTube. Anyways, you should probably see my past video of how to get your uh, Steam account back if it's been hijacked. Well, today I'm going to show you, it's kind of off topic, but I'm going to show you how to share your files on iTunes. Alright, so what you're going to do is go to your main computer that has all your music that you want to share from. So go there, open up your iTunes, open it up, see I already, I'm already hooked up to my uh, main computer. I'm on my laptop right now, so that's why it's a different running system. So once you do that, you're on your main computer, you're going to go to Edit, Preferences. From there, you're going to go to Share my library on my local network. Local network means it's going to only be shared with that wireless router that you're hooked up to right now or any cable within the area. Um, once you've hooked up to that local network, you go ahead and share all you want. But when you see it requires a password, you're going to have to find the user. If not, then you're going to have to be bum out of luck and not even use any music at all and just use yours. Another thing is, is that when you're sharing your library with your friends and you have no password, you can just have them, yeah, well, maybe you can only watch my TV shows and 90s music and my top rated. That's all you're going to listen to. But we're going to uncheck those. I'm going to put share my entire library. Then we're going to reset this password. It's an old password. Reset. Press OK. You're going to get a pop-up that says sharing music for personal use only. You're going to press OK. And to make sure that it's running, you see, that also shuts down if you uncheck to look for sharing networks. It's going to shut down. If you want to see if it's running, go to Preferences again. It says Status On. No users connected. So that means it's up and running. As soon as you connect with another computer, go ahead. So I'm going to go back to Look for Shared Objects since I already have a server up. So press OK. Oh, there's my other server. Click that password. Enter in the password that you put it on your computer. See it loads up. It's been running really slow, so I'm gonna be surprised if it loads up the next Wow, okay. I'm amazed. Anyways, that's all my music right there. And so if you have any questions about that, that's how you do it. If you have any more questions, go ahead and leave a comment on uh, YouTube. If not, PM me. Um, it is 11.58. This is when I do all my genius ideas. Plus, at the same time, if uh, you have any ideas of how-to videos you want me to start creating and try to work, go ahead and send me a PM on YouTube. If you know me personally, send me an email. Anyways, I hope you all have a great gaming experience and have a great music in the background. I'll see you later.